I'm gonna have to lean. All right, dang, y'all got real quiet. No, we, we we can still be personal even though we don't start. Did we start? I can't even tell. We went to get dry. I know All right. I was waiting for you. We didn't exactly. start. We, we thought you were about to do something because your your camera came up. Oh, okay, we are we started. What's up? All right, now we are here, you guys. We're here for a trooper drink night. Please don't mind us. We have been talking for a while, so and I think some people started drinking before others. <laughs> Way before others. Well, what's up, y'all? You already know what it is. It's your girl, baby, the one with the East Coast swag on these West Coast streets, and you are here for another episode of Speak Up, Speak Out, Speak Aloud podcast tonight is truth or drink game night i am here with the lovely artist simone make sure you guys keep in touch and keep up Hello. with her what's up simone hey uh, how are you <laughs> good good thank you for asking i'm sorry y'all i'm just i feel like I'm, I'm about to fall but we are also joined by another artist we have michael george ross who, by the way, just dropped a single today called Black Pride. Michael, how you feeling? Me, 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 me. How y'all doing? I can't. I'm trying to chairs doing? right here. It's okay. Leave it. Just leave it. We're all right. Sorry. Sorry about that, y'all. I'm talking to production the same way. But Michael, this is what always. What happens when you get me drunk? <laughs> this is what happens when you get me drunk? Well, it's always Thank a Brian. pleasure seeing you. I'm Thank glad you're you. drunk. I need to start drinking. Shoot. We also have. Mr. Christopher in the building. He is the funniest video movie commentator on Instagram that I have ever heard. He is truly, truly hilarious. If you don't follow him at the end or any of these artists, you will have a chance to get their information at the end of the game. You're making me laugh Chris. the whole time. The whole time. <laughs> Chris, how you feeling? I appreciate it. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Now, to let you guys know, so the game, of course, is called Truth or Drink. You have questions that is going to be asked to any of the participants in random order, and they will either have to ask it, I mean, sorry, answer it honestly, or you go take a drink, which is kind of telling the truth anyway. He is in the building. He is production for Olive Tree Queen Productions. Let's give a round up for him. Woo! Also my baby Danny. <laughs> nice to me, production. I'm all right, we started to get cut off. Well, the baby took it out. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get started with some, don't look at that one. We're going to go ahead and get started with some questions. And go ahead and go ahead and do the questions. Go ahead and do one of the questions. Or well, let's take a sip real quick. Everybody, what are you drinking on? I'm drinking real American Bud Light, but I'm cute with it. I got it in a glass. I'm cute with my eyes. I got my Yingling uh, 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 chocolate Yingling. I thought it would be good because you know Yingling is one of my favorite beers, but this chocolate one. Does it taste like a, like the coffee? See, I, I'll finish it off some 1800 that I had earlier, but I'm going to take it in my Beverly shot glass Ooh. that my sister brought me back when my freshman one. year in college, and I have kept this, I'm, 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 and it's like, that was 2011, it is now 2021, oh. so I'm going to keep it up this way. and I okay. have it three or four times, yeah. so every time I use it, I tell her, so... No, I love you, sis. Oh, okay. That That's nice. awesome. That's a good... Simone? Okay. Hold on. I'm trying to set my camera up because I finally got my phone a little bit charged. So can you give me a second? I'm sorry. All right. Since she got that filter, so she might give us a silhouette challenge. <laughs> no. Oh, no. 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 I'm not trying to use that. <laughs> so can see me. There we go. Okay. Look, anything is uh good right now. The times that we in, so you're good. Yeah, okay. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like we everybody been drinking a lot more than we usually do. So you know. Look, the way these patients to be set up, you know, people don't have jobs these days. You drink. But out here, they sell whatever you can get, and then some till two in the morning. So. <laughs> They be drinking out here, y'all. Let me just tell you that right now. 
All right, so Mr. Robinson said he is ready with the questions. He is going to go ahead and get started. All right, so the first personal question will be to Simone. What is your go-to oh. karaoke song and why? Ooh. What's my favorite karaoke song and why? Yeah. Oh, my gosh, this is so easy. Okay. So, my favorite karaoke song is Pony by Jane Wine. What? Okay. That's my favorite song. That ain't no karaoke song. Yes, it is. is. That's my karaoke (laughs) song. I sing it every time at karaoke. My boyfriend is a DJ, so he he does karaoke. That's the one I sing all the time. Yes. Okay. I sing it while you're in reverse cowgirl. What did you say? (laughs) I said, did you sing it while you're in reverse cow glory? No. Okay. All right, now. What's the freaking song I mix with? It's a Jodeci song. Um, but I can't think of it right now. Because I. that's just my favorite song. I don't have a reason why. I just like it. I've liked that since I was a little girl. That's it. The oh, little girl. girl. <laughs> I love funny since I was a kid. It came out when we were kids. Yeah, well, yeah, that's true. That's true. Oh, <laughs> Michael, what is the weirdest place one of your songs or part of the lyrics came to you? Ooh. You said the weirdest place? (laughs) Yeah, what is the weirdest place one of your songs or a part of your song lyric came to you? Um. On the toilet. I would have to say the weirdest place would have been overseas at uh, the Moulin Rouge, y'all, the Moulin Rouge was the most weirdest place, but it inspired me to make all of Southern Hospitalities, okay. the song Southern Hospitalities. But Moulin Rouge in Paris, it's like a hole in the wall, and there's, like, people outside, like, naked. But let me tell you, like, there ain't no, like, cute naked. I'm gonna just say that. <laughs> and they be looking dirty, too. But that was, that was the weirdest place. Oh, no. Mm-mm. Yeah, that was terrifying. It does. <laughs> Let me tell you. Sounds oh. like it's star, you. <laughs> oh, my oh. gosh. What's the next question? Okay, Christopher. Oh, nice. oh. Ready to get drunk. Let's move on. Christopher, <laughs> what is your favorite movie to watch but can't help talking through? <laughs> question is for me since y'all and let's see what this question is Ooh, baby yeah. that's my part right there. can that you dance that movie. i'm sorry i was thinking about it okay go ahead oh okay michael said okay. <laughs> that's rude okay <laughs> can i dance listen can i dance you better tell them can I keep a beat? Uh, do I have rhythm? Yes. Are my dance moves, um, you know, do they have names? No. But you'll have fun out there with me. I can't. So I'll bust a move on you that you ain't never seen. I'm trying to tell you. But I'll be. I'll look good doing it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, oh, no, you said, no, you said- Dances of today don't have no names that you be trying to do, or you mean the ones from the past? Why are you calling people out? I want no detail in this question. Wow. Okay, and I want no detail in this question. Listen, I be trying to do wow. what you always do. Okay, 
It's it's just I think it's all together. You know, my dancing is called the spirit and it moves me within side. It's the only the question I think was really needed to be asked. Ah! Do you know how to work? Do you know how to throw it back? Listen, I done got a little thicker with snicker, okay? I can I can move something in my mind and when I'm drunk. Oh, she moves. She body yaddy 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 yaddy. So now we're going to get into the drinking game. These questions are for everyone on the table. So anyone can speak up and be honest. And we can see each other to see who is taking a drink and pleads the... Now, I'm going to call your name. I'm scared. By the way, I'm already drunk, but okay. <laughs> I know. You must see my elevation. We're just going to see the elevation. I got to work in a moment. Uh. All right, so I'm going to call your name after I read the question. So if you want to answer the question, you know who I'm talking to. And then I'll call the next name, the next name, the next name. Okay. Oh, I thought it was for everybody. It is. It for is. Him. It is. He wants us to answer in, in the order of he says our name. But the question's for everybody. The questions oh. are for everybody. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. But so the viewers can see if you answer the question or not. Legitimately. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, I'm nervous. All right. I may turn my camera off. <laughs> that is cheating. <laughs> That's cheating. That's cheating. All right. <laughs> the first question. Your career takes off and your closest friends make up your business team. Before going forward, who would you need an intervention and an extreme makeover before being seen with you? Oh. Michael. Oh. Mm. Well, fuck it, dog. Intervention. I'm listening. I might need. I might need the interventions. They might need to sit me down in the intervention. I might be the one with a makeover. <laughs> Although I am a model, don't do me, don't do me. So you just broke rule number four thousand forty-two. Oh, so you need to drink, drink, oh. sir. Oh. You need to drink, drink. sir. Drink. All right, Christopher, what's your answer to that question? Don't count. You gotta say oh. your name. And go ahead, Simone, cause you you know. <laughs> I'm going to call is Simone. Yeah, that reaction. Yes. Because um, <laughs> I ain't going to 
drink on this one. Ooh. Oh, bro. Talent, 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 talent. This was in her soul. Hold on, y'all. I'm sorry. How long you Probably like 30, 40 minutes. Uh, sorry, y'all. No, you're good. Sorry. <laughs> um, okay. So, if when I, not if, but when I do make it, all those people that are out there that say they support me and don't support me at all, I'm a tough one. Fuck you. Ooh. In that order. Yeah, and that's about it. Like, that's about it. I can love you from a distance, but it's still. Oh, it's still gonna fuck you. Yeah, it's, it's gotta be that. Because uh, there's a lot, there's a lot of that stuff that goes on in the city that I live in. And y'all who live in this city know what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. But, uh, and I just, I might not want to go a little bit too far into it because I'm going to put my personal emotions into it. So, but the, it's just those two simple words. That's it. Yeah. That's it. So can I ask a question on top of that question? No, because you talk a little reckless for me. I don't like it. Oh! Oh, be nice. There go. Oh, oh, nice. Ooh. Oh, me, 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 oh, me, me. All right. Gonna be nice. Okay, so what's up? No, it won't directly at you. I'm just asking in general for that oh. question. Okay. So what? What do everyone feel support is? But can you really classify that to something? Because I can support you through prayers and not necessarily buying. Without anybody knowing who I was. And that was a little bit, a little bit too much to me, a little bit too quick. And then when all that hype went away, the people went away. Know. Yeah. Gotcha. I'm waiting on you to ask me. My go ahead. Go ahead. Ah. The only reason I I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wrap all y'all up and real quick. I'm gonna get y'all together real quick. Now the only reason you is right for my own. What your answer would be. Oh no, I was saying I was I respect you on what you were saying, Samoka. I know I know people that feel the same way. And like some things I just like that. Exactly. But, that's but, great. That's great. But that's great. support. But yeah. there's some people out there that won't do that. There's some people out there no, that'll no. be like, Oh, I like your stuff and all they do is like your post and they won't actually go to your it ain't my turn. It ain't my turn. No, no, I I get it. <laughs> Some people also don't still don't feel that that's support. They feel like you have to purchase stuff to be supported. So that's why I wanted to try to figure out what do people classify as support. That's why I was wondering. Okay, well jump that in the question and then call classify your support and then give your answer. Just just support like okay like liking a video, sharing a video, commenting on a video. Um, just spreading the word. If you go out and you say a person's name, like you be like, hey, you know, like, look at this person, look at this artist. Hey, I've been looking at this part person, I've been following this person, doing this, doing that, and doing a lot of stuff. But one thing that I will say, we, and that, and y'all know how to support. Y'all people know how to support. You know what I'm saying? What I want to say is. We're bigger than Jacksonville. Hey, baby. So when you sit around and you try to get people from Jacksonville to support, you don't get none of this. You don't get none of this. You don't get none of that, none of that right? Because these people aren't going to support you. They say they will just to be up in your face because what, what do they have? Jacksonville. Yeah. Look at it. It's Jacksonville. There are 7 billion people in the world. There are only about 4,500 or 45,000, I think like 40 or 10,000 in Jacksonville. Forget them. Yeah. Go somewhere else so that you can be getting to the back. To the back. These are Gucci. These are Gucci back. Okay. <laughs> this is what I'm getting. Because you know why? I got out of Jacksonville. I got out of Jacksonville. Uh, Gucci bag. I love it no so much. I love it no so much. No shade, just sunlight. 
It ain't shady if it's the truth. Exactly. Not at all. You said no shade, just sunlight. I like, I like that. Yeah. That. To me, even if you don't like my, my content, or even if you don't believe in my platform, you can still support. You know what I'm saying? And I 100% agree. You know, life is bigger than Jacksonville. But I want to say life is bigger than where you from. You you have to branch out. Because I branched out from Jacksonville to people in Charlotte and Greensboro area. And they told me, they was like, oh, we didn't think you were serious. I'm sorry, what? When I first pitched doing this, building this platform, this podcast to elevate others. I'm not even doing this. I'm trying not to curse because I'm working on me. I'm not even doing this for myself. My my whole obligation and what I want to do is to elevate others, to 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 level up together. I literally just want to put a platform for others. My platform is to build and to help you with your platform. But to have people say, oh, I didn't even know you were serious. And these are the same people who... I'm making posts say, hey, check out this video. You guys check out this video or I'm putting stuff on my social media. Exactly. Right here in Jacksonville, just like we're saying, if the people, you will get some in Jacksonville that will support you Absolutely. and stuff like that. But then there will be those people that will lie to you. Just like, I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm a well-known artist, right? I feel like I'm, I'm well-known around Jacksonville. But there's still mm-hmm. people that come up to me every single day and be like, how can I find your music? Yeah. All you have to do is type in Michael George Ross on any platform. I made it that way so that it would be easy for anybody to find my stuff. But And I put it on all my social media sites and everything. That means nobody's reading my, yeah. the stuff that I'm putting out there. People are telling me to promote myself. I've been promoting myself. I promote myself every single day, if maybe, not three, four times a day. Maybe it affects more when it's internal support, where it's where you feel credit is due and they're not i think that may be it i don't know chris what do you what's he say Hmm? what what is your point we're gonna go ahead and we're going to um we're gonna chris i want you to oh you gonna sip on this one i mean i I mean i give a little spill i know we got on a time thing um i would say like how when it comes to me, um, so I just started doing this podcast with um, some other, another group of people in January. So <clears throat> what I did was I hit up people on social media that I'm friends with, with school with. I was like, hey, can you just go to the Instagram page, like, follow the page, click on the link for the YouTube thing, and just subscribe and like. Like, you don't even have to watch the video. Like, just like it to help get the views up. Like, if you want to watch it, cool, but I'm I'm not going to press nobody to watch it because I know people's attention span is short. My, my attention span is short because I, I want to see you succeed. Well, that's you nice. Mean? I wish, you know, I mean, I can say that. Some people are supportive in that way. Also, that with, they those, do with those YouTubers and subscribers, <laughs> if you look at it with those. All right. I take a shot while we wait. Yeah, I'm about to chug I'm this. Go ahead, and, go ahead and drop Michael one more time. While we wait on Simone, we're going to listen to Mr. George Ross. All right, now. All right. Y'all going to see me. I got to hop on the throne, so make sure don't nothing come out. All right, now. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, there you go. <laughs> you should have danced. You should have danced while you was hopping up there so they don't know that you're not real to all right now, I told y'all, I did walk it like a dog. <laughs> Can y'all hear it? Hey, keep it real, tell the truth, or take a shot. Now look, whatever you got right now, because it was such an easy beginning, go ahead and chug what you got right now. Go ahead and take a shot of what you got right now. Because I need everybody warm on the inside. So I'm going to finish it up too. Mm. Damn. Be nice to me. I just went to virtual church this morning. Look, that's how you know you owe. All of us went, mm, mm. <laughs> All right, Mr. Robinson, go ahead. Mr. Robinson, go ahead and start again with the questions. Okay. 
so weird action is. What position do you really enjoy <laughs> for your own pleasure? I'm a drink because production is my baby daddy. Good choice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Clearly, if we got the baby, you had all positions, baby. Look. Now, look. <laughs> Is there a friend you have that you would knock the fuck out, Devo style, or vice versa? <laughs> and you ask that again and put family in there, and then I got you. <laughs> okay, is there a friend or a family you have that you would knock the fuck out, Devo style, or vice versa? Oh! It's the way he says, knock the fuck out. <laughs> Of three. <laughs> Listen, I don't think you want me to be honest. My best friend, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like my best friend Tashir, I feel like if we was to really get in a fight, she probably knocked me the fuck out. Just cause I talk so much. I mean I can fight and don't get it twisted. Anybody watching <laughs> These paws from the street. Don't get it twisted. Okay. But. She, no, don't let the jewels fool you. But now she, you know, she from, she from, she from, her people's from the country country. Like, like dirt road. <laughs> I really feel like she could knock me out. So I'm not going to lie. Because I just, we don't, we both just seen each other fight. So I feel like that would be a deep match. I'm going to keep it honest there. Tasha here. You can deep on me, girl. I know you can. <laughs> Come on, man, for you. Get y'all that Zeus account. Put that fight on, on get some money. Whatever. Yeah. Who else Who else gonna answer it or y'all gonna drink? Who y'all gonna knock out? I don't know that I wanna knock out. I don't know. I don't have nobody I wanna knock out. Personally, I would, personally I'm gonna have to drink on this one. Oh. Just to save the friendship, I feel you. I understand. So anybody of Chris's friends, just let y'all know, he be thinking about knocking y'all the fuck out sometimes. Just like, <laughs> but, and, and, and to be fair, I think it's vice versa. It's just like certain times, it just be like it's yeah. arguments that sometimes make you do. It's like at the end of the day, you know, y'all still y'all still rocking for somebody else. They can't hit you, but you know. <laughs> yeah. I feel you. Simone, if you had the the chance or if 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 it got that far, you're such a you're such a magical unicorn. I don't think anybody I know some of the people that are so-called friends or family members, I'll deal with them because I like to have my own little space. Yeah. So, Okay, so what you're saying is if there was somebody who you ain't deal with but they want to give you your space, you would knock them out. Yeah, but I don't have anybody <laughs> that's like that. So, yeah. Oh, don't let the magical unicorn and love and all that fool you. Like, I was out here. I was. I was fighting. Okay. <laughs> but, nah, I, I just know. Oh, well. I'm a, I'm a... In honor of her unicorn, you must drink. <laughs> oh my god Michael who is the three heart. people apparently <laughs> it's so I think, hard. Michael, I think Michael should take a drink for every third person I know right like he got a list <laughs> he look like he's still thinking about hitting him look at him oh, oh, take another sip go take another sip not you got a folder a folder. a folder. <laughs> With pictures in them. <laughs> the height, the date. Premeditated murder. <laughs> you know, 
So you literally have a burnt book, just like in Mean Girls. Mm. I got the one where when you walk in the hotel room, they got the uh, the red uh, lines going from each picture okay. to each picture from scene to scene. Okay. That's me. Oh, Lord. <laughs> What's the next question for he up here with premeditated murder? I'll take a sip. <laughs> if I say nobody. But I just want to let you know, mess with me. I'm put you in that folder now. You don't want me on that folder. <laughs> they gonna fold you and then put you in the folder. When I look to my bodyguard and I say, "Go get me the folder," you better, oh, you better Lord. watch out. Go get me the folder. The folder in the trunk. <laughs> Go get the folder out the folder trunk. In the trunk. Go get me the folder. Right now, I need the folder. Look, what color? What color is the folder? What color is it? Red. <laughs> All right, next question. Many of us have followers we have known for quite some time. And as we got older, they got more annoying. If you could tell one person on your social media page they are doing too much, who would it be and why? Who, who answers that first? Uh-uh. Yo, whichever one of y'all, just...
but she lived like in like California or something. I don't know how she even ended up following me. I really don't. But you better I, I get you a sugar like, cougar. Look, she was telling me that I was the same age as her son and all this, and I was like, oh, okay, that's nice. And she just kept going, so I just went straight to the block button. And that was it for that. Like, I, <laughs> And I'm like, I don't know you. You talking about stop dating me and want to have kids? You just say you had kids. Like, what There's this woman on my Instagram that does that. She asked me to send her pictures, and I'll go to her page, and she posts all these dark skinned right. black guys. She'll be posting them, and she'll be asking me for my picture. I'd be like, no. <laughs> I don't even respond to that, and she'll still do it every single day. I'll be like, no, I'm not sending no pictures. <clears throat> but you can go listen to my music here. It goes right here. My <laughs> Oh, oh our cover. I guess I'll do a cover. Okay. Um, so I have music coming out, you guys. It's just it's in the works. I'm working with Toe Red right now. Yeah. A couple of my songs. Yeah, a couple of my songs. This one that I am about to release is really dope. I just it's not completely finished yet. So yeah. Okay. What am I gonna sing, you guys? Let's mm -hmm. see. Um, you can okay, sing your karaoke it. song. Where we'll go, baby, I don't know. Maybe we should just let nature run the show. Where we'll go, baby, I don't know. Maybe we should just let nature run the show. But yeah, that's. That's it. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh, keep going. Yeah. I love I love your voice. It's just so. Right, I, I, I love it. Okay. You know, say more. It's chestnut coming out the shower, glistening. It's just make you feel. All, I mean. <laughs> Watson. All right, Miss Watson, what you trying to hear? What you What's know? the most shallow reason to not go on a second date? What is your most shallow reason for not going on a second date? And ain't nobody drinking. I want to hear this. <laughs> I mean, a, <laughs> a shallow reason. A shallow reason. A shallow reason. Oh. This for everybody. This for everybody. This for everybody. Oh. It's slingshot. Oh shit. A shallow oh, reason not to go out on a second date. Um. His car was dirty. Like makeup. Like makeup worn, or this is like an actual thing. <laughs> His <laughs> car was dirty. If you show, I don't know. Yeah, your car dirty. Listen, I understand we all, you know. I don't think I have a shallow, shallow thing. I the only time I went on a second date is because the person was in their phone the whole time, and I don't think that's shallow. Yeah, that's not that's not shallow. I hate that too. Don't be in your phone the entire time. If you gotta look I at got your phone, oh, who got you one? Didn't spend enough money on me. That's shallow. Spend enough money on that's me. fucking shallow. <laughs>
Mr. Robinson said, next right. question. If you were asked to push a relative off of the San Diego Bridge <laughs> and return... <laughs> Hold, hold on one second. If you were asked to push a relative off the San Diego Bridge in return successfully achieving your dream in $50 million, who would you push and why? Yeah, what? and ain't no drinking on this one either. I need to know. No, you, I said if we could, you said if we could push somebody off. If you were to... Um, it, okay, so if you had to push somebody off the San Diego Bridge... That was a relative. That was a relative. And in return, oh, you would you would be successful following your dreams, like the career you want, um, and you had $50 million, who would it be? Oh, there's, a lot of them. there's a lot of them. Can I line them up? Do, Do y'all know the San Diego Bridge? <laughs> Rescue boat coming for you, you know. But I just need you to take this drop. Oh, I got some cousins. Oh, <laughs> so it's, it's water. It's water there with it. Yeah, the San Diego Bridge. You, you. Oh, I didn't know what he's. All right, the next uh, game uh, is gonna be. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? You can put sharks underneath mines if you want to. Do I get? Do I get fifty million more? Oh my gosh! I push them off. You know what? We're not going to talk to a murderer no more. I'll bring them off. It ain't no problem. You just got to let me know when. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so is no one drinking on this question? Everybody willing to sacrifice a relative is what we say. A couple. A couple. No. Um, Simone didn't a answer. I, I can't. Look. Aw, Chris taking a shot. Oh, Simone. Daddy, we're not related, but oh, okay. Well, you know, he gotta go, he gotta go. It's okay. Mm, but it was like, like, they gave you like these little, like, uh, green and purple, like, beads because it was like a little theme, like, party. But I was good, I, I didn't want them. <laughs> I was trying to hurry up and get up off stage. I was like, I don't want to buy this, you gotta pay for this, okay? You gotta pay a lot of money to see all this, so I don't know what to do for them. They can't see this no more, okay? Damn. I don't know why I would have done it if that happened. Oh. Michael got case files. That's hilarious. <laughs> Rob's uncomfortable. I'm just reading the... And I can't wait to talk to you guys. Love you guys so much.